<sighs> so Coco, we are in season three, and that is so amazing. <laughs> you know what? Let's do a recap on our best episode. Oh, oh, okay, Mama. Well, we have to start with what made us. Oh, um, Mama, I pee in the bed. <laughs> <laughs> Mama. Mama. What, Coco? I peed. Okay. In the bed. Seriously, why do you keep doing this? You're eight. I, I, I had one of them dreams that I peed on the toilet. So yeah, I peed in bed. Coco, take your butt in that room, take them clothes off, and change them drawers. Dang. You don't got no empathy for none of your kids. Coco! You said you just peed, but you didn't boo-boo too? I'm about to empathize with your behind. <laughs> oh, Mama, remember the second one that we made? Mm-hmm. When you were doing things you weren't supposed to be doing. <laughs> oh. You better not. Coco, you are not grown. Don't make me call your dad. You know I will. I, w uh, I wasn't going to do the next part, Mama. All right, Coco. Okay. Uh-uh. Girl. <laughs> anyway. Oh, remember the episode when you made your first hit? <gasps> Little Bo Peep lost his sheep. Jack and Jill went up the hill. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. Mary had a little lamb. The living never coming back. No. no. Let's see it, Mama. Period. Mama. Yes, baby. Uh, I know what I want to be when I grow up. Now, Coco, in the past few months, you have done ballet, soccer, track, and you didn't stick with any of those. Are you sure this is what you want to do? Yeah, yes, Mama, I'm sore. I'm going to show you. Okay, Coco, what do you want to show me? Rhea, hit my beat. Mama, she been practicing. <laughs> Lil Bo Peep lost his sheep. Jack and Jill went up the hill. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. Mary had a little lamb. That lamb ain't never coming back, no. Okay. Um. Period, Pooh. That is your daughter. You're right. It is. <laughs> now, now, that was a hit, Mama. It definitely it was. It still is. It still, still is. is. Um, and then came the Mother's Day episode. Mm. Oh, I remember that all too well. Give your mama something today for Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. Dun, 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 dun. And complete. Mama's gifts are here. Thank you, Mr. Delivery Man. It can't get too close. You might got Rona. Mama, happy Mother's Day. Oh, thank you, babe. What is all that stuff? I got you some gifts, Mama. Here you go, Mama. Coco, where did you get the money to get all of this stuff? money card on the table. <laughs> Coco, how much money did you put on my card? It said 10 something, just a little bit of monies. Coco, you put my account in the negatives. I only had a hundred and something dollars. I didn't know you was broke. <laughs> well, you know, after that one was episode seven when it was had a little issue. Oh, yeah, I remember that too. <laughs> Oh, it smells better now. Thank you. Coco. Huh? Did you do your schoolwork? Well, I thought I dropped out, Mom. I haven't been in school since March. You know good and well I'm talking about your e-learning assignments. I'm trying to, but they got all these T's and dashes. What T's and dashes, Coco? What are you talking about? These. Let me see, Coco. That is addition and subtraction symbols. Let me help you. Okay, so what you have to do is take Mama. the- Coco, would you listen to what I'm trying to tell you? I'm trying. Okay, 
So like I was saying, you have to take these two numbers. Mama, I know what you're trying to do. What am I trying to do? You're trying to kill me. How? How am I trying to kill you? Your breath. My breath does not stink. It's tragic. You didn't have to say it like that. You didn't have to smell like that. Girl! <sighs> I'm so happy it doesn't smell like that anymore. Yeah, yeah, anyway. You know what? I will never forget eight when you tell me there was a whole stranger in my house. It was. I'm up. It's a man in my room. A man? Coco, what do you mean a man in your room? Yeah, mama. He a big man. He so <laughs> real loud. Let's go get him. No, Coco, I need to call the police. We can take him. He's asleep. I'll grab his nose while you hit him in the head. Coco, no. Sisters are in there. But police gonna take too long, mama. We can tackle him. Okay, Coco, let's go. I cannot believe I'm doing this. Maybe, maybe I should just call the police. Maybe I should call no, the police. No, mama, get it together, okay? Get your stuff. I got mine, okay? You waiting, mama? Yes. Let's get it. Wait, wait. We need Vaseline. Vaseline for what, Coco? In case he scratches our skin. I can't be looking crazy, mama. Just get the Vaseline, Coco. That's why I wish my daddy was here, because if daddy was here, we would knock him out cold. Like, did, knock him out like Tyson. You know your dad is out fighting wars. This is not the time to talk about which parent you like more. Well, he out fighting the wrong war. He needs to be here fighting the war that's about to go down in my room. Okay, Coco, be quiet and let's go. Okay, Mama, when we go up in here, you can't be acting all scary, okay? Okay, Coco. Okay, we gonna go in there, one, two, three, knocking them out. One, two, three, finish him! Mama, I got him! I got him! Coco, got him. what are you doing? Coco, that is your sister. Sister, my foot, Mama, this is a man. He just looked like Ari. Coco, get off me! <laughs> so you woke me up because your sister was snoring? I'm sorry, Mama. Uh, I am so happy she got her snore under control. You know, leave your sister alone. <laughs> oh, Mama, what happened to Miss Norway? Oh, you're talking about season one, episode 18. Oh, hey. Okay. I'm just about ready. Yeah, thank you so much for being able to come last minute. I'm really happy my cousin was able to recommend you. Okay, no problem. I look forward to meeting you and your children. I'll be there in about 10 minutes. Okay, thanks. Girls! Yes, Mom? I was able to get a babysitter, so please be good and listen to her. Coco. I don't want to hear that you did anything that you're not supposed to. I'm not, but these two. No, Coco, I'm talking to you. Okay, okay, she's here. Hey, hey, come on in. Hey. Hi. Thank you so much for coming. You know what, you actually look familiar. Yes, I, I bet I do. I met you and your daughter a few weeks ago when she ate my sandwich. Oh my goodness. I am so sorry about that. I told you I'd see you soon. You still hungry? <laughs> well, come on in. Uh, these are my daughters, Ari and Rhea, and you already know Coco. <laughs> you know, I, I don't think this is a good idea. No, no, wait, wait, wait. I promise Coco is going to be on her best behavior. Um, I'll see you guys later. There's food in the fridge. They already took their baths. Okay, bye. Uh -oh. Okay, let's, let's go watch a movie. Oh, movies. What movie are we watching? Whatever you all would like. How about Creepy Crawlers Take Over the Universe? <laughs> no, no scary movies. You know they're going to give you nightmares. No, it's not. Miss Nori, do you like scary movies? No, not not really. I'm so happy you're here. What? Who is that? Come on! Ooh, it feels like a puppy. Well, it's not. Woof, 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 woof. Look, are we? Ew, no! Ew, I don't want it. Oh, give me this. Uh-uh. <clears throat> that is it. It is time for bed. Uh, I'm sorry, Miss Nori, but just to let you know, your your puppy hat is a little sideways. Hey, I'm back. Mm. Uh, how did everything go? How does it look like everything went? It's falling off. Oh. So I'll, I'll call you next time. I, I do not call. 
call me. I told you, this is exactly why I don't like other people's kids. Bye. Bye, Miss Norway. <laughs> oh, then there was season one, episode 41, when I took over for Thanksgiving. Yeah, your um, <laughs> Thanksgiving prayer was interesting. I love God. <clears throat> hey Coco, you want to play a game while the turkey's still cooking? Oh yes, could Ari, Mama, and Daddy play too? It'll make time go by faster because I'm ready to gobble, gobble, gobble! Yeah, but Mama and Daddy probably just want to relax. You know, Daddy just got back from the Army and will only be here a few days. Oh, okay. Well, I'll go get Mama and Daddy then. <laughs> not just leave her out there. She knows we aren't asleep with the Thanksgiving meal cooking downstairs. Well, we could if you just act like we sleep. <laughs> Stop playing. I hear you all laughing, and Mama, I know you in there with your hand over your mouth and your eyebrow raised. How does she... Stop. What else? too loud. No, I'm not. Hello? Guess I'll get the door. No, 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 no. Look, she knows we're up already. No, I'm going to get the door. <laughs> Hi, Mama. Coco, do not bang on my door. Now, yes, sweetie, how can I help you? Oh, oh I didn't know that if you could hear me. Uh, Rhea's downstairs getting the game ready so that we could all play. Oh, oh, I want to play too. Can I play? Okay, you all. We'll be down in a second. We'll be down in a sec. Okay, Daddy, don't take too long. Mama trying to haul you all to herself. Excuse me. Change, 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 change. Guess what? Mama and Daddy come downstairs. <laughs> now I told you they were busy. Oh, you meant like right now? Hmm. Well, they're not. Oh, you just don't listen. What are we playing? Financial Jumpstart Academy. <laughs> All right. I guess it's time for game night with my favorite ladies. Let's play. Woohoo! Let's get started. Yay! I'll sit next to Daddy. Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay. Excuse me. Okay. Coco, just make sure you play fair. I always play fair. That's you and Rhea. No, you don't. Okay, stop it, you two. Look, we're all going to play fair and we're all going to have fun. Okay, so the name of the game is Financial Jumpstart Academy and you learn about finance. Okay, okay, that's cool. Let's play. Wait, wait, wait. I don't even know the rules. It's okay. Don't worry. Just uh, follow my lead, okay? Okay, a person who owns a business is a... Okay, Coco. Entrepreneur like me. Because <laughs> I rap, I cook, and I'm a magician. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, look, it is a blessing that we're all able to be here today. 
it's unfortunate that due to COVID that all of our family couldn't be here, but next year will be even better. Honey, we love that you're home for the holidays and we appreciate you so much. Especially me, daddy. <laughs> cool I mean, technically she did thank the father and said grace put a little spin to it too <laughs> thank you daddy a to the a to the a to the a to the amen 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 amen, amen. 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 Season one, episode ninety four, when we went to Troy. Yes, it is one of my favorites. Even though you did embarrass me. Thank you all okay, for come, come. Sit right us here. here today. Okay, Mama. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> Sit down. The truth, the truth, uh oh, the come the talk. Truth. Shh. This morning, we will be speaking on speaking our truths. Uh, the verse says, if Christ is truth, uh, then it falls that lying is moving away from Christ. Yes, speak that, Pastor. The more we follow Christ, the more we become. Sister Delilah, come on up and let God hear your voice. Joyful, joyful, Lord, we adore thee. to tell. So we're just gonna act like you didn't kill him. Kill who? The squirrel that you ran over with your car and left his body there. <laughs> Coco, when we get home. <laughs> oh, oh my. Oh, poor baby must have been traumatized. Um, well, all right. About this sermon. Yes, let's get back to the sermon. <laughs> oh, oh, wait. And guess what, Pastor? Mm -mm. That pretty little hair that you see on her head? That's not hers. Tell them about the jail braids under your wig, Mama. Show them. Take your wig off. <laughs> <laughs> Continue, Pastor. <laughs> <Sit down. laughs> uh, amen. And then how about episode 100? Oh, the big one, yes. Whoop. Even though all that work I put into your hair and you did what you did. Oh, Coco, you can look so cute. I just love picture day, don't you? Yep, 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 hooray. <laughs> Smile, Coco Puffs. The pictures are going to come out perfect. Yeah, well, I hope they do after all this torture you put my head through for this hairstyle. And it's perfect. Coco, please do not mess up your hair. Your pictures are being taken at the beginning of the school day. Okay, mama. Well, hopefully these kids hurry up, smile, and keep it moving because I'm ready for my pigtails back. You are so silly. Coco, you are one of those kids. Okay, go ahead and go in and I'll see you later, okay? Love you. Bye, mama. Bye. <laughs> Tiger stool. You don't look too bad yourself, but you could have fixed this 
fighting with hell a little bit. Well, excuse me. This was the style that I was going for. But anyways, luckily you get to go first today so that way you don't mess up your hair. Oh, it's cute. I, I like how you're missing a seashell and how it's a little lopsided. You know what? Go stand over there for a second and I'll let you know when it's your turn. Okay, thanks Miss Tiger School. Finally, a mirror. Mama got me out here looking like little Miss Rosie. Fix my heel. I'm Coco. They can't smell my foot. They can't have my heart. I'm gonna do my piggy tails. I love my piggy tails. Cause I am beautiful. No matter what they say, words can't bring me down. Oh, oh, oh. Mama want my hair be fancy, so I make a little fancy. I'ma tease it like I saw on those videos that the girls be doing. Then, then. Hmm. Okay, I'm cute. <laughs> All right, kiddo. I need you to strike a pose. Okay, ready? One, two. No problem. I'm sure your mother will be very surprised. Hey, Coco. How was school today? Uh, hey, Mama. It was good. Uh, Jeremy was in the lunchroom picking the jam out his toes. But other than that, nothing major. Uh, your pictures came and I opened them already. Huh? That is gross. And what pictures are you talking about? The ones that you forced me to take. Coco, I did not force you to take anything. Now pass me that picture. I'm so excited. I can imagine how cute you look. Let me see. Okay. Ooh, let me see my babe. Coco, what is this? You like? What happened? Wow, are they that pretty? They must be perfect. Coco, why? Your hair and your clothes were so pretty that day. What is this? And where's the color? Who, who, who is that? You. It's you. This is you. That's who it is. Oh. But mama, mama, did you see my bang? It's beauty. Now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. With pretty pigtails and a smile that makes us giggle. What can we say? That's just Coco being Coco. Now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. With pretty pigtails and a smile that makes us giggle. What? Then we had season two. Yeah, yeah, uh, season two, episode 45, when we had the virtual talent show and you decided oh, yeah. to I <laughs> tell the whole it. class. Oh, you killed it. You get all right. All right. And I'm just about done. <laughs> okay. Are you sure? Yes. Uh, just putting the final touches on it so that it's pretty perfect. <laughs> okay. Nice. Let me hear it. Oh, dang it. Actually, we don't have time. It's time for the Zoom. Don't worry, Mama. It's really good. You're gonna be so proud of me. <laughs> I'm sure it is. You are a great writer. Thank you, Mama. Okay, let's get you all set up, Coco. Okay. Oh, that's such a nice hat, Coco. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. <laughs> okay, she's starting. Hello, all. Hi. We are so excited to see your performances today. 
Thank you for preparing and we wish you all the best. Take a deep breath and let's get started. Do we have any volunteers? Okay, go ahead, sweetie. Hello, uh, my name is Coco Streety. Uh, it's really Constance, but you can call me Coco and I'm gonna do a poem today. I remember when I was four years old and it was cold, cold, cold. Mama sold my coat, so I remember walking in the cold, cold, cold. Burn. Every day was a blur, but I made it to school just to hear Mrs. Nelson purr. Teaching the same stuff we already learned. Why me? Why was my life so cold, cold, cold? Mrs. Nelson, teach something new. We already know about Jack and Jill and how they went up the hill. Excuse my tone. You just have to stop. I had to hear that just to go home. Walking in the cold, cold, cold. To hear mama tell me she stole my sister's coat. Okay, oh. stop, stop. <laughs> Just one second, yeah. <laughs> Coco, I am going. <laughs> yes, yes. Well, you know what? Let's go ahead and clap it up for her. Yes, yes. I'm not really sure whose story she told, but it was not hers. And I promise, I did not sell any, any of their coats. <laughs> But we're just going to go ahead and go. And best of luck to all the other contestants. <laughs> Great. Thank you. <laughs> Coco, what was that? A poem. <laughs> I put a lot of work into that. You know, maybe I should have added more effects like it was cool. Co 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 I didn't really get the reaction that I was looking for. No. No, you shouldn't have. Yeah, you're right. Maybe I should have told more stories about how you sold our coats. Co I never took your coats. Let you tell it. Mm. Yeah, that was interesting. It was amazing. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, my favorite one. Season 2, episode 58, mm -hmm. when I was playing the piano. Yeah, and we, you were doing so well, we thought. Coming! Thank you as always for coming to give Coco her lessons. No problem. Coco is definitely one of a kind and she's fun to be around. Well, thank you very much, Miss Haja. Well, you're very welcome, Miss Coco. Have you been practicing what I taught you? Yes, I've been practicing. And how's it going? Oh, um, you know, it's going. You know, I just press this right here. And then I head on over here and I press this right here. You know, it's, it's going. You know, I, I love my music board. It's a keyboard, but I'm happy it's going good. I'm gonna let you practice a little and then we'll get started, okay? Uh, Ava, can you tell me where the restroom is again? Yes, ma'am, follow me right this way. I gotta get something up and back anyway. Huh, here I go trying to fake it till I make it. Oh man, it took me forever to even learn to turn this thing on. Why didn't I practice? Coco, you know practice makes perfect. Okay, let me get it together. Okay. Ooh, I have an idea. Okay, just for today, and then by next week, I'll have it down pat. Alrighty, I'm ready to see what you got. Hit it, Coco. Oh, okay. Um, have a seat, please, and sit all the way over there because it helps me focus better when you're not able to see my keyboard. Let me get comfortable. More over there, please. Oh, okay. Um, okay, here I go, Miss Haja. I 
mean, Coco, that was incredible. You must have really been practicing this week. Yes, I've told Mama Incredible should be my middle name. Yeah, I'm just really trying to figure out when she practiced because I, I never hear the keyboard. But nonetheless, great job, Coco. Thank you both so much. You know, I try to make sure that I put my all into it. You know, it's sometimes it just takes practice and you got to do what you really need to do to Go marching in, all when the saints go. Are they still looking? Oh, oh, hey, um, what, what happened was... What happened was you were playing the tune that's already embedded in the keyboard. Uh, yes, but, um, and there is a but. I was going to learn it next week, but next week hasn't come yet. I wonder how Miss Raj is doing. Oh, good. Maybe she'll come give me some more lessons. Really? <laughs> anyway, oh, season two, episode 67, when you were asking what was I like as a child. Oh, yeah, you so cute, Mama. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Hey, Mama, what were you like as a kiddo? Were you more like Ari, Wea, or your favorite child, me? First of all, I do not have favorites. And let me see. Um, I definitely kept my mom on her toes. I was curious and I got into a few things, but it all came from a good place. Were you really energetic? Um, hmm. Let me think. Yes, Ava. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Please stop doing that. Uh, doing what? That hi, and you don't say anything. You know what I mean, little girl. Oh. <laughs> uh, well, I have a very important question. <laughs> okay. Ask your question. What's your question? Uh, you must probably do something with your hair instead of wearing that scarf to church. Maybe a wig or something. Oh. There's nothing wrong with my scarf. My scarf is sharp. Now, Ava Marie, you go get ready so we can go. Ava Marie, it's time to go. Stop, drop, and how about roll? Make you want to hit the flow. One, two, three, five, four. All out of order, what do you know? Go get ready. And I'm out. Mic drop. <sighs> yeah, those were the good old days. <laughs> funny mama so to say the least you were more like Rhea <laughs> <laughs> well it sounds like I was more like you than I actually thought about you know my mama said I would have a little mini me one day <sighs> she was definitely right oh no wonder you're such an amazing mama <laughs> am I gonna be amazing too one day <laughs> oh thank you Coco but absolutely you're gonna be an amazing mom one day, even better than me. That sounds hard to top. But you know what? You're right. I am gonna be even better because I'm gonna let my kids jump in the bed. They're gonna write on the walls. They're gonna do whatever they want. They're gonna eat whatever they want and the list goes on. <laughs> I'm just playing mama. I'm gonna make sure that they eat chocolate covered fruits so that they can get their nutrients while getting their sugar at the same time. <laughs> yeah, I definitely <laughs> then there was season two, episode 85, when I was having trouble falling asleep and you... Oh, and I was very helpful. You and, and no, were not helpful. To go to sleep. Almost, you were almost helpful. <sighs> um, is everything okay? Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm fine. Judging by the bed moving like we're on a boat, it doesn't seem like everything's okay. Oh. <sighs> I'm, I'm having a hard time falling asleep. I can tell. It's okay. Okay, come here, Mama Bill. It's okay. Come to Coco Buns. Come on. I just don't know. Shh. We have to get some sleep. It's late and you can't do all that talking. Try to get back to my dream. I was just about to take a bite of your sandwich. Oh. Uh, okay, okay. You're right, you're right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, Mama, just close your eyes and okay. do what I say, okay? Okay. Uh, 
Hope this helps. Oh, it helps. I prescribe it to all my clients. Now lay over there. Oh. Wait, did you say your clients? Shh, mama, do you want to be able to fall asleep or not? Yes, I do. I'm just kind of concerned because... Shh, relax, mama. Deep breath in and out. Come on, deep breath in and out. <sighs> I think it's working. Don't get too excited. You're going to destroy the sleep that's coming. Relax. Come on, mama. In and out. In and out. Now, this is the second part, okay? I'm going to sing to you. Yeah, I don't think that's going to work. Trust the process, my sister. What? I mean, Mama, trust the process, Mama Bill. <sighs> okay, go ahead. The breathing seemed to help, so I guess I'll trust the process. Okay, thank you for giving me a chance. <sighs> sure, Coco. Okay, let me go. <sighs> Walk by the mama on the tweet top. When the wind blows, the cradle will fall. When the bell breaks, the cradle will fall again. And down will go the ma ma ya 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 Cradle and on. <laughs> hey, Mama, I know you're sleeping, but you got to go back over there. Back on the deal. Coco! Uh, sorry, Mom. Good night. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then there was season two, episode 93. Oh. When you. Ash to ash. Ash to ash. Sorry, little doggy. Ooh, what's this? I wonder what Mama got this for. Ooh, it's sand! how helpful you've been around here. You're really maturing. But um, I wanted to talk to you about something. How would you feel if I had another baby? A baby what? Like a baby cat, a goat or something? No, like a human. A baby brother or sister. Oh, um, look, let me clean up and I'll get back to you with the answer. Okay, well make sure you clean that up. I think this will be really good for our family. I mean, it sounds interesting. Have you talked to Daddy about this? Mm -hmm. Yes, I have. Oh, no. That's okay. I think me as the baby is enough. <laughs> I'm going to sit down, Mom. Okay. I'm... <laughs> um, Coco, where, where did you say you got that sand from? Oh, I did it, Mama, but I found it in this thing that was on the table. It's so pretty. Please don't. Okay, P please tell me what was what was in the vase is still in there. No, the sand that was in here. No, I used that. Mommy, you gotta use the bathroom. No, Coco, I don't have to use the bathroom. What did I tell you about touching things that do not belong to you? Uh, not to touch them. <laughs> Exactly. You just played with and flushed Carmen's dog's ashes down the toilet. She asked me to keep them here until she was ready to bury them after a few days. So, you mean Miss Carmen's dog died and I just spread his body parts all over the table? 
and flush them down the toilet? Yes! Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Well, I guess it's time to move on to season three now. Oh, yeah. The first one was uh, the princess party. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was memorable. You dressed up for that one perfectly. I did. All I want for Christmas is a lot of stuff. <laughs> Coco, why aren't you getting dressed? Uh, getting dressed for what, Mama? Your friend's princess party? Oh, that is today. Okay, I'll start getting dressed. It's gonna be so cute. You and all your little friends dressed like princesses. Oh, and I'll do your hair as soon as you put your dress on. Uh, no need to, Mama. What do you mean? Coco, your hair needs to be done. Don't worry, I got this. I'm gonna be a different kind of princess. Okay. I'm gonna look so cute. Ready, Mama? Huh? Yep, I'm ready. Look at me. Coco, what do you have on? You're supposed to be dressed like a princess, not a puppy. We don't have time for this. We have to go. Uh, I am. That's, that's my pup's name. <sighs> Coco, you will not go there dressed like a dog. A puppy. <laughs> it's a princess party. And I'm dressed like princess. No, you're dressed like a puppy. Yeah, a cute one. And they should have been more specific if they wanted a specific type of princess. <gasps> oh my goodness. Come on. We have to go. I cannot believe you are going to <laughs> here, here I come up. You know, I really don't understand why you couldn't dress up like a princess. Like Princess Tiana or someone like that. <sighs> Mom, okay, let's do the next one. Let's, okay. We don't have to talk about that well, anymore. Okay, let's, let's not. Yes. Episode 20. Um, uh -huh. The Secret Santa. That was definitely a surprise for me. What an exciting time of year. Okay, Coco, since I'm your Secret Santa and you're mine, we can exchange gifts now. Okay, yay. I really hope you like what I got you because I put a lot of thought into this. I'm sure I'll love it. Okay, I'll open mine first. Oh, I bet you this is that arts and craft kit that I wanted. Or not. <laughs> I'm sure you'll love it just as much. Oh, oh my goodness, thank you, Mama. This is exactly what I wanted. Yes, I know. You had it written on your list ten times. Oh, I didn't even think you would know that. Well, I can tell you this. I sure couldn't miss it. <laughs> okay, my turn. Wonder what you got me off my list. Oh, uh, um, well, you can probably open yours later if you prefer. No, nope, I'll do it now. Ooh, I'm so excited. Let's see what we got in here. Do you like it? Are these my shoes? And are these shoes from two years ago? Uh, well, well it, it, it depends on... Depends on what? Your dad gave you money to go shopping, Coco. Oh, mama, is that what that was for? I put that in my piggy bank because I was trying to save it like you taught us. Yeah, I'm still just wondering what happened to the money your dad gave you for my gift. I shaved it, of course. Mm, anyway, finally, episode 26, when we were wondering what that sound was in the house. Oh. Oh. And we are the only two in this house right now. Now I know it wasn't me. Well, did you fart in your sleep again? You know yours can get really loud. No, I didn't fart this time. I was sleeping. I heard a loud like. <laughs> Coco, call the police. Hurry up. What's the number? 911. Uh, uh, Mama. I don't see 11 on here. Oh. Coco, 911. Well, Mama, you said 11. Uh, okay. 
Uh, hello, Mr. Policeman. Um, there was a burglar trying to break in, and Mama and I are about to set it up. And I'm gonna tell you something: we are not punks. Um, yes, we are. Can you please send help to 1127 Sesame on a Bird Drive? Hurry. Coco, did you leave the TV on again? <laughs> I'm I'm sorry, officer. I think I think we're fine. Huh? Uh, well, I didn't leave it on. I just forgot to turn it off. <sighs> I cannot believe I called the police and almost had them come to our house. Yeah, that's why you have to be more careful, mommy. You have to make sure you turn the TVs off. Me. Mm -hmm. Okay, but anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching these videos with us as we show you our top favorite episodes mm -hmm. we hope you enjoy make sure you go watch all the rest of them all and them. all the ones that are about to come yes we can't wait to be with you all on this journey see you guys soon Bye. Bye.